California. I'm out here because friend of the show, Shawnee Poo, uh, he got married. It's early and we're gonna go to some garage sales today. So let's let's see if there's anything good. I'm looking for shirts, bro. I'm looking for sweatshirts. I'm looking for bullshit. All right, fine. I haven't been able to go to garage sales in years because I normally work Saturdays and Sundays, but since Sean had his wedding on Friday, fuck, I have the weekend off, so I figured, you know what, I'm here, let's make it happen. There just so happened to be a neighborhood garage sale going on around the corner. I'm a little early, but I don't think it's gonna be that big of a deal. I'm kind of excited, fuck yeah. This neighborhood is super, super nice. I hope that some of the stuff is just as nice. Mm. By chance, do you have any old t-shirts or anything like that? No, I don't, sir. No, okay, cool, awesome, thank you. It's hard to even shoot anything because there's nothing to shoot. Pretty much all retirees, which could be cool, but they don't really have much stuff. Good for them. Scored some old golf hats. Here we go. Yeah, let's party. Did you hide the skeleton brothers? Pardon? Did you get you hide the skeleton brothers? Uh, someone wanted to buy them. Me. I bought them. So I uh, I put them back here. Cool. Thank you. Oh, I love them. All right, I got my skeleton bros, and uh, off to the next. I'm not quite sure the age on those things, but if uh, you know in the comments section below, leave leave a comment and let me know because they seem to be maybe. 80s or 90s anyway they're pretty cool <laughs> these are great vintage tags on them score <laughs> well i'm definitely not a celtics fan but these hats are cool and i'm a fan of cool hats he wanted five bucks a piece for them definitely wasn't going to argue with the guy because they're probably worth a chunk of change so yeah cool he was a nice guy he's got this bobby brown cassette that you can't see as well not every day you see an insane clown posse while you're browsing garage sales this gives me hope Oh. Scored a couple shirts, sweatshirt, and a bag. All right. All right, rolling up to the next one. Hopefully it's not a bunch of horse shit. More, hopefully more insane clown posse t-shirts. That would be the fucking jam. Cause who doesn't love a, a good violent J shirt? Whoop, whoop. Oh, that's an old towel. Wow, that's so cool. I'm gonna see if they wanna sell that. All right, so she wants 10 bucks for the towel. It's so fucking cool. I said, can you throw in Lederhosen Mickey? And she was like, why not? And I also got a bunch of fucking old metal shirts. Some are reprints, some aren't. Fuck yeah. That was pretty fucking cool. Those people were awesome. Lederhosen Mickey, totally worth it. I can see how people get really into garage sailing. All right, this one's up a hill. I smell, I smell something. I gotta take a shit. Oh, you're gonna clean? He loves to sleep. Good job. Good job. Are your CDs and... DVDs for sale? No. They're not? Okay. This guy's got hand painted tombstones over here. Uh, uh, you would think that hand painted tombstones would scream great yard sale? Dog shit. Horse by the hour! <laughs> Alright, you know you're running a shit fuck of a garage sale when you tell the people that you have collector's items. Yeah, fuck all that. Wow. The Super Bowl hat and the Pro Bowl hat were kind of cool, but at the same time, I've sat on so much Super Bowl shit. That's really not even worth it for me to pick up on that stuff anymore. Would you guys have picked it up? Leave a comment down below. All right, now I'm gonna head to Lincoln and see what's over there. I saw a couple of garage sales. I'm kind of in the garage sailing mood right now. So uh, yeah, let's let's party. Lincoln, here we go. Oh shit, they got maps. What, what are people selling? I got a bunch of stuff everywhere. Any, anything good on here? Free lemonade? Yeah, this is Score. So I think I'm just gonna kind of cruise and it looks like a bunch of toys. I'm gonna go back to that. Yeah, this guy's a giant fucking piece of shit. Hey, brewers, all right. Uh -huh. What I've noticed about a lot of these is there's like a people just selling like random little bits, like four or five things in their front yard. Uh, what the fuck? The jacket is two bucks. <laughs> Tatanka, I loved him. That was like going through the used section at a Kohl's. A lot of families here, so there's a lot of like young kids stuff and baseball bats. I don't really fucking move that stuff, so I don't know. They didn't have shit back there, but they were selling cookies and I got roped into them because they looked so good. So I'm gonna get these for my friends. So what I noticed is, is that a realtor is putting these on, both the ones here in, in Lincoln, as well as the one in Auburn. Yeah, both been real estate agents. Interesting way of getting the community involved. Kind of love it, to be honest with you. 
Fart, fart, poop, but a poop, but a poop, 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 poop. Yeah, just a beautiful neighborhood with uh, nothing for sale. Sick, a free air hockey table. This thing is tight. Makes me wish I had room or a house or a place to live. So at this point, I've probably been to about 15 of these houses and there hasn't been anything of like that's been cool at all. Uh, no, no clothing really other than like kids clothes, uh, no cool toys. There's been a couple things here and there, but for the most part, just kind of dog shit. Yeah, these are like, your, oh, your brother, you have a, a brother or something? Yeah, my older brother. What's uh, Bakugan. Bakugan, okay, they're, cool. They're like little things you can battle with, and some of them have little gadgets like uh -huh. this one. Got a Wii, Mario Kart, a Star Wars game, and a bunch of Bakugan figurines. And there's a Switch game somewhere in there too from those kids. I'm not gonna lie, those kids were the coolest, and they had the best stuff out of all the all the sellers here so far. All right, I think that's gonna do that for the yard sale. So I'm gonna go over and do some hair, and then I'm gonna show you guys what I got. I'm uh, sorry, I'm uh, sub about it. I'm way far away from where I started today. I came here to meet a friend of mine but it's, this location is really strange. It's the first time I went to Wiener Schnitzel, as well as where I got my license to do hair, right down the way, very strange. I got, got really strange vibes over here, but there was a lot of really great places that I hit up. Um, those kids that I bought the Wii from were awesome. Uh, there was this, these, uh, this older couple who I bought the skeletons from, super cool. The young kid who I bought all those metal shirts from, he was awesome as well. That beach towel is awesome. So there was some really good finds today. Um, really was an eye opener as far as garage sailing goes. I haven't done that ever. It's actually, I, I, don't, I can't remember the last time I went to a garage sale. So now that I'm not working every single Saturday and Sunday, I'm gonna start hitting them, they're fun.